Oh the yeah, sexiest this, androids. This is gonna be Eden Club. Connor and Hank. Connor and oh, Hank. It was like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. Okay. Are you sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. So the face model. Let's get going. Mm -hmm. For Connor, his fiance is one of the sex androids. Really? Yeah. Kind of cute. And They've weird been way. streaming the game together, which I thought was really cool. Mm -hmm. So his fiance is the face model for the sex androids. Do which one? Uh, I'm assuming there's going to be more than one, but. I think. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. <laughs> this is going to be an uncomfortable David Cage level. I can just feel it. <laughs> Welcome to Eden Club. Oh, there's dude. There's one dude. Oh, no, two dudes. Three dudes. Three. three dudes. Equal number of men, or female and male droids. Connor, the fuck what? are you doing? I'm, what, I'm looking. <laughs> Leave me alone. I want to look. That's so awesome that he yells at. <laughs> Nineteen for sixty-six. I, I want to make sure we hear like what they're saying. Twenty bucks for sex. By the way, Gallant Part Two. Oh great! Dead body and an asshole. Just what I needed. Connor and Hank. Connor and Hank. I just can't like I. I know this is supposed to be like a titillizing level, but I just feel bad. Well, I think I know it's on the inside. To make you feel bad though. Lieutenant Anderson and his plastic pet. What the fuck are you two doing here? We've There's been assigned super... to all cases involving androids. Oh, yeah? Like wasting time. There's some pervert who, uh, <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> I'm fucking weirdo. We'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. Come on, let's go. That guy's disgusting. Uh, I'm starting to stink of booze in here. I appreciate that Hank is just kind of like, lieutenant. whatever. And didn't like, you know, bro out with him at all. I think Hank just like, he drinks because he has to work with that guy. <laughs> 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 so this, I think, is his fiance. Critically damaged. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. <laughs> Puke again. <laughs> Connor, you're so nasty! <laughs> I could go for a whole TV show of just these two. I really could. Were those, those were all the things? Is this going to be like uh, L.A. Noir where we like roll him over and his junk flops around? That's what I was just thinking about. Yeah. It's like L.A. Noir where you're like, don't contaminate the evidence. And, and you're like, like pop and a you're... squat on top of her and just fondle her whole body. And you're literally like flopping the body around. Okay. Michael Graham, 6 to uh, 6 24 p.m. is the estimated time of death. Signs of strangulation, cause of death, asphyxia. Cardiac arrest, no sign of cardiac event, heart attack, not cause of death. Ooh, reconstruction. Victim was strangled. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been a rough play. Reactivation required. Repair the only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Yes. 
Yes. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. Oh, so we gotta pay attention to what questions we ask it. Okay. You were damaged and I reacted to you. Everything is all right. Is he... Is he dead? Yes. Tell me what happened. He started... hitting me. Again. And again. Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. That's what he said, there was two of us. What model was the other android? Did it look like you? <sighs> I must have stressed her out too much. No, they had a timer. But the timer like There's jumped from a minute android. to like 11 seconds. Oh. This happened over an hour ago, it's probably long gone. No, it couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. If you oh. could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. So someone explained that every time Connor dies, his emotions reset. Oh. He still has his memories. Yeah. I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk But if much, he you know? dies, he doesn't Come do his in, coin tricks. Do business, and like, every time he away. dies something, he loses They're something. Oh. And that's why... So you fucked no up. Shut I'm up. Just I'm just, just kidding. <laughs> shut your dumb mouth. You shut your face! You shut your stupid face! <laughs> Can we talk to these people? Same model. Just vanished. May I find out what happened? Here, what, what about the... Search for an Android eyewitness. So let's walk around. Can we talk to these people? Probably don't what have about in CCTV in there. Oh, find second Android. Okay. Hunt. There's no way. It's, it's a barrier. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is what people appreciate about eating blood. About discretion. So we can't talk to the, any of these dancers. can come and go without a trace. No, I'm trying to. First of all, awesome skin though, look. Oh, she's got it's sparkly glittery. skin. That's the only bonus of being an android. You can set I your, want. Oh my gosh. You can set your hologram to glitter. That sounds fucking awesome. So go wild. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the more I learn about people, the more I love my dog. Oh, examine. Connect. No fingerprint detected. Please try again. Need human fingerprints. Hey, call, hey, hey, hey. Can I borrow your fingerprints? Chew my ear off for half an hour so we don't. Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Can you get this, Tracy? <laughs> for fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. Or you could just say I want to talk to her instead of like, please, I just really want a bone. I like how he just he assumes Hank has biological desires. A Thirty minute session costs twenty nine ninety nine. Please confirm your purchase. It's not at the front. Twenty bucks for an hour. Oh, maybe she's like a special sparkly model. Not gonna model. look good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. Human club wishes you a experience. Couldn't we talk to the owner and say, hey, can we talk to this thingy? Delighted to meet you. I think Follow that's me. his fiance. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? Now we bang we go, her. Yeah, we now we double team <laughs> Oh god. Holy shit. What the hell are you doing? Not in front of everybody. What am I looking for? I think you're playing There's, the timer through. I know, but it's it's we're in the orange. Oh, okay. He's gotta be oh 
blue haired Tracy headed toward the entrance. It saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Oh shit, okay. So we have to find somebody closer to the door, maybe? Hey, what am I supposed to do with this one? Tell you changed your mind! No, we should... It headed towards the entrance. This is the entrance. Oh, okay. I... We, so we gotta talk yep. to her. Uh, let's try this one. Hanks have to pay me. so much. Suspect out of sight, check another android. You didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive in investigation of my career. Well, if I was being paid, maybe I could pay, but no. So she's heading over there. Turn back into the club. I saw the blue haired Tracy. One. I know which way it went. This one? Then go for it. Right here? That one over there. Where? There are androids everywhere. This one? How are you gonna tell which one saw which the one? Tracy with um, blue hair? Maybe this I one? I know which direction it took. I just need to find another android on its path. Nice. Good catch, Stacy. Turned into the red room. I still wish, like, the only bonus of being an android at this sex Sparkly level. skin. Sparkly skin. Alright, so we gotta pick somebody. Pick, yeah, one of the guys on the wall. Okay, she went into that room. Yep. Move, Hank, go! I mean, to Connor. Connor. Can you like speed walk or anything here, guy? Hey. Hello. Hit in that room. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. So I think this is supposed to be his fiance, but I could be wrong. Well, the Tracy model? I, I, don't, I don't, just one of these, somebody, one of the women in this situation. Maybe one of, is there a person, maybe this guy. She left the room, so yeah. hopefully. Nothing. What should they do? Come this way. Are you this guy? Oop. Oh, there she is. Fled through the staff door. I know where it went. Follow me. Oh, fucking A. This is crazy. He's loving it, though. Yeah. He's like, good job, Connor. Yeah, I know. We're gonna have, we're, we're expensing Wait. like sixty hours of. I'll take it from here. He's, He's worried that Ank will get killed. Ooh. Connor. I mean Connor. Ooh. So we were looking for a blue-haired Tracy. It was me. I did it. Too late. No. But he's over here. Look for a blue one. Yep. It's hard for me to see in the. Ooh. Lick it. Lick it. Bah. <laughs> yeah, you nasty. Yeah, Connor. Yeah, you like it. <laughs> Search for the blood trail. But in the box. 
What's in the box? What's in the box? I feel like this is a recreation Christ. from the movie Look. Seven, but oh, they get used till they break and then they get tossed out. Now we're just uh, now we're just reading a. Okay, we're just gonna skim through this because I'm worried that we're like on a time limit that's not being said. Yeah. So I'm sorry for and not. And people can you can pause and read. Usually we read it, but I'm sorry. I didn't read the whole thing, by the way. Nope. I want to go to the next uh, thing so people can read it. All right. Okay. Oh, and I think that once we like do that, can't we find them somewhere in the menu or something? Yeah, we and we get points for it. Okay, uh, so there's one over there, but let's see. The blood goes here. She, there, there she is. is. Oh. oh. Don't move. They're all oh. fighting. Oh, like, I feel bad. Wait, hold on. Oh, God! Oh, God! I just don't want to fuck this up. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. Pleasure, so I feel bad because like we're we're part of the system. Mm -hmm. But I guess Connor didn't have a choice in this. I hope Connor, you know. Oh, oh my friends, God. friendship. You wanna run away? You better run away! Leave them alone! Let them go! Let, Let them, them go! go. They're getting away. Oh, I, oh, I, oh. no, I messed that up on purpose. Oh, oh shit. I, like, I'm trying not to die, but I also don't want them to be caught. Yeah. Like, how do I let them escape? Uh-oh. Spare. Spare. Leave those androids lesbians alone. When that man broke the other Tracy, I knew I was next. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. And so I put my hands around his throat, and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive, get back to the one I love. Yes! I wanted her to hold me in her arms again, make me forget about the humans, their smell of sweat, <laughs> and their dirty words. Come on. Let's go. Hank's gonna be like, you know what? Just go. <laughs> cool job. Good Hank. Good on you, Hank. I know. Hank's well Oh Run! Be free! free! Did you hear what he said? What did he say? It's probably better this way. Hank's changing. Because of Connor. Oh and it's God. beautiful. I am so invested in their storyline. So I think it's, like, really interesting how Connor's, like, working for the system. But, like, he is developing this relationship with Hank. And he's realizing that androids are more than these things that he hates. Because mm -hmm. he hates them for some reason. I don't know why. But he has a reason. But now that he's, like working on these investigations and each time I think he's learning from the investigations like every time there's a deviant it's always because their life was in danger yeah it's kind of like how when I had a daughter I realized that they're people too <laughs> <laughs> kind of like when men have daughters and they go oh no now I have one 
And then other guys are going to do that. <laughs> no! <laughs> Stacy doesn't have a daughter, by the way. I don't have a daughter. I don't have any children. We're making fun of how, like, some men will yeah, this say... Is, this is definitely nowhere even close to all, but, like... Some men will be like, oh, like, I didn't, like respect women no, no, until no. I had they, a daughter. They say, like, as a father of two daughters. Instead I, of just... I know that women are... Pe- like, we, we're we we're making a very, like... This is not all men. Uh, this is just a def- statement that yeah. is sometimes said. And it's not even that, like... The the thing is, is that, like, I, I, I understand that they're trying to, like be like, oh, like, uh, as an ally or whatever, like, that they're trying to, like, tie it to their own experience. No, in but the, in- the issue with saying something like that is that you make it sound as if, like, somebody who doesn't have a daughter or, like, who doesn't have a sister, like, can't possibly empathize with Women. other people. <laughs> yeah. You know? Um, it's the same thing as the people who are, like, you know, oh, but, like, but my, be- but, like, my friend is black. And it's like, well... Okay. It shouldn't take... That. <laughs> you, you know, your your uncle being black for you to empathize with black people. So I I love the character development of Hank. And I'm also, you know, Connor, he's working for the oppressors. And he's, on the most part, he hasn't let the other ones go. Like, I wish I... And don't you, be you like, guys, I can't believe you guys let the lesbians go, but you arrested all the other ones. I'm like, no, we didn't have the option before, well, guys. We, we could have let Kara go. Oh, yeah, we did. But I, like, that was an impulse. We could have let her, her go, like, three separate times. Yeah, sorry. And Heidi. every single time you were like, no, I gotta get him! Because I didn't want to get Connor in trouble, but I also wanted Kara to survive. It was hard. But, um... Well, Connor got hit by a truck, so it all worked out okay. Yeah, it's Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Connor's working for the man, so he has to die at least once. But let's see. If you shoot her, I guess bad things happen. If you okay, we want. If you lose the fight, I wonder what happens. Because I wanted. Well, to hold lose on. Him. So you have to. You oh have yeah, to- I remember every single time there's a scene with Hank, you can die. Oh. So this is probably Hank dies. I mean, not Hank. I mean Connor. Every t- single time there's a scene with Connor, he can die. Oh, okay. So that's so, what somebody well, told me. So here you have to you have to win the fight and spare the deviant uh-huh. in order to get the ending mm, where they the s- precious lesbian escape. ending. And then it looks like, but it looks like there's two paths to that, and I don't know where the other one's coming from. No, it's just two different ways because oh, you can lose just... the fight and then go back up. Yeah, L- but lose the fight and then do something else. Um, there was, oh yeah, so I wanted back when, like, the other fe- gynoid female android protected the other one, I was like, they're lesbians, but then I was like, no, I can't assume, uh, android sexualities or, well, romanciality. Uh, no, the only other, the only reason why sometimes I don't want to assume that people, that's, like, the two women together are lesbians. The only reason is because I like the idea of there being female, fr- like strong, female friendships. strong female friendships. No, like you should be able to have both, obviously. Mm-hmm. But like, I never want to be like, I don't want to be that person who. It's kind of like, would I always assume that like a man and a woman are involved? Mm-hmm. No, I don't. So mm-hmm. I just try to, you know. I wonder. If so, like so, their if their romance is asexual, like they're romantically involved but not sexually involved, does that make sense? Well, it depends how. I mean, like if they're androids, they're built for sex, but are they like? Do they enjoy sex? Does that make sense? I don't know. I think that, but that's probably up to each one of them individually. We've already seen that they all have different personalities. Mm -hmm. So I would think that they each get to define themselves differently Mm -hmm. in terms of their sexuality and gender identity. And that's what would determine what, what you would call the pairing, I guess. What I'm curious about is like, did they give the androids with sexual capabilities the ability to enjoy it? And it, it's like... I don't understand why they would. You, yeah, it, but see... Yeah, that's, like, my question is, like, 
would they even enjoy it? But I'm saying, like, why would they give them the ability to enjoy it? We've already seen that they don't care about anything the androids feel. And, yeah. like, just look at how doctors used to treat, like, human women with <laughs> sex. <laughs> they were like, the female orgasm just doesn't exist. Or they were like, they're hysterical. Quick, get the vibrating dildos. And they're like, what? And they're like, just just do it. Yeah. Well, I meant more like that they would just be like, well, just women just don't enjoy sex in the same way that men do. And it's like, Ugh, well, there's still people today. It's just like, shut up. Yeah. 